We are backstage with Angels and Airways, yeah. you guys. How about that? Hello. Very excited to have you at Acoustic Christmas. Well, thank you uh, for inviting me back in the building. It's been a few years. It has. I uh, know there's a few restraining orders, there but are. I'm happy to be here. We lifted them for one night. It's far good. It's far away enough from a school. Yes, and, yeah. but don't try and come back tomorrow. Or from a zoo, if you will. Yeah. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Go on. Yeah. <laughs> from a zoo. Um, how does it feel to start playing live again after, what, seven years? Yeah, it feels great. We started off a couple months ago on a, a U.S. tour, and we are still going hard through uh, wintertime, and and it's amazing. Your and next stop is Milwaukee. That's going to suck. It's actually, I'm telling I don't want to have to correct you. It's Milwaukee. Okay. Oh, right. Oh. right. I, mean, I have read awkward. that. Awkward, yeah. yeah. I have yeah. read that. Kevin, I'm just saying it's 60 yeah. here and it's probably 120 below there. So. Oh, my God. I, you know what's crazy about that town? Have you, Alon, have you ever played like Eagles Ballroom and all that? Yes. It's wild. There's this building where all these people died down yes, below. Yes, it's like haunted. It's what? haunted. Yeah. I think uh, the, the, the hotel across the street is Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeffrey Dahmer had some. Oh, so delicious meals. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Milwaukee is better than I thought. <laughs> I would go on a tour of this that, town. That is the best next stop. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait, can I ask how everyone died downstairs? Was this was like at one time? There's a pool okay. down there that's drained, and everyone there's like 11 people drowned in it. And I know this because uh, back on the Warp Tour days. Okay, but what about the other 89? The 89 people? You said 100 people. Those details are not important. You just I'm not good with math. Just roll with it. You know what? They never covered the pool. Okay. It was yeah. just people kept falling <laughs> yeah. in year after yeah. year. They're still falling. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Sorry, go on. Well, in any case, we used to do mushrooms and go down there. Go on. On okay. the Warp Tour. Yes, mm -hmm. please do. Yeah. And, uh, and I remember I went down there with this hardcore band uh, from Warp Tour, mm -hmm. and um, it's like 120 degrees out there. It's super humid, but when you go down there, it's freezing. Oh no! And everything spooks you out because everything looks wild. You yeah. Know? You're not. You're not on uh, vitamin C. Sure. You're right. on on uh, mushrooms. You're on mushrooms. Right. Yeah. Right. No, that's the end of my story. I'm sorry. Well, no. I mean, I understand what you're saying. I, but do you, do you believe? Can I just say, if you don't mind, that yeah. was an anticlimactic. Well, it's an indie. End. It's an indie story. Okay. <laughs> well, I just bought the rights to the movie, so I'm going to be writing the script about it. I'm, I'll I'll keep the same ending. I laughed. Uh, I cried. Uh, do, are you? Do you believe in that kind of stuff? Like, do you think that like that? That place is spooked and gruel. Have you I'll met what? Tom uh, DeLonge? Well, no, Does I mean, he believe not, in that stuff? If they're not well, aliens. Those are dead people. No, no, yeah. He's into things that are otherworldly. You're talking about the people who are still That's here. That's what that I mean. Yeah. yeah. The stuff that I'm into, nobody on earth understands. Sure. <laughs> That's okay. just where it ends right but there. Same with me, but because I'm ridiculously <laughs> dumb. <laughs> I have, I, you know, it's interesting. The whole paranormal thing, I think... We everything that's ever been really paranormal turns out to be kind of more normal later on when right. science discovers it. Sure. So I think one day we'll find out what the whole ghost thing is. But mm -hmm. I think there's too many people. I've watched those shows on TV where they get scratched and stuff, and yeah. you're like, what's ha what's that? What it's is that? Oh, you mean like ghost hunters? Well, I didn't want to throw out. I watch different ones. Well, I like the I'm Ghost sure. Hunters one because they're, like, they're like, it's like totally well, Ghost the Ghost Hunters yeah. one is like, they're like three bros. Yeah. And they like walk in like, come on, dude, come and, out, Ghost. And not only that, their jeans are bedazzled <laughs> and stuff. Yes. Yeah. It's basically like Chris Angel if he yeah. Fought, yeah. like look for ghosts. It's Chris Angel, yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what, though. At that specific venue, sure. I was there once many years ago, and I did receive a blank text message that was dated to the 70s, which is obviously Seriously? Whoa. I swear to God. Without no. phones At, back then? Exactly. That's what was weird. Did you know that it's also the last venue? I swear to God. Buddy Holly and Richie Valens played out before they died. I what about the Big Bopper? Yeah, was the Big Bopper was he there? He, he must have been there because he was on the plane, or maybe he was hitching a ride. And it was oh. a bad call. <laughs> He's like, Come on, Tom, your story doesn't add up. He's I'm like, Come on, Tom. <laughs> I don't know everything, woman. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> which, which brings us to another question. I want to ask Alon. Does he ever? Does the phone ring and he ever just go, "Sorry, DOD." Uh, to me? Sorry, CIA, I got to step out. <laughs> oh, oh, you no, don't no. have clearance. No, that's to um, Does that that's everybody else that he says no to because he's on the phone with these you, other people. You know what's funny? Yesterday, I was in the car with our manager, and I was on this call, and I, I was a two-hour call, and we were driving up towards Santa Barbara County, and for almost the entirety of it, I kept muting it and kind of fill these guys in on some of what was being talked about. And um, and it was something it like was that. It was the Department of Defense. It was affiliated with that. Okay. Yeah. Well, now they know you're not paying attention. You're like, right. well, they're talking. You're yeah. well because I don't have much to add. And you're telling everybody else. It's a, it's a defense contract stuff with my company, and I honestly, when it gets to that realm, even though I am CEO and chairman of the board, it makes no sense whatsoever. You're not a CEO. But I, let's I, I'm be not. I'm trust me. I'm. Okay. But the entertainment thing is, you know, I I'm fitting in that division well. But when it gets into that stuff, I do just mute it and let everybody else talk. They're much smarter than I. Yeah. Yeah. Every guy I talk to. Just mutes it. It's pretty much I mean, like yeah. full-blown conversations. Yeah. I'm like, that, so yeah. anyway, what do you think? And then you hear, 
<laughs> so nothing. Everything's pretty cool. It's very sad. Yeah. This Angels and Airways are here, and we're so excited to have you tonight. For the right. Hey, yeah. this is uh, it, by the way, this is a it's a big honor to be here tonight. Our band has been away for a while. Yeah. We've been putting out music, but we haven't been touring. I'm really thankful to be here. Obviously, I've played at this event for many years in the past with Blink, but uh, this is this is awesome. I'm really really excited, Excellent. and I'm thankful. So thank you guys so, so much. So are we? Tom. We are. Tom. Tom. Yeah. Well, your face doesn't show it. Tell what are you yeah. right? I was gonna say no. tell your so face. So are we? It's tell, tell it to your, your face. face. Tell it to your face. Yeah. Okay. And then I say I'll sell it to my penis. And then I tell. And I kill a bunch of kids in Milwaukee. Yeah. See you guys. Oh, dead kids.